In today's video, we are going to be looking at a university that is located in a city in Germany known as Darmstadt. And Darmstadt is a beautiful city in the south region of Germany, in the region of Hesse. And in Darmstadt, we have a university known as Technische Universität Darmstadt, Technical University of Darmstadt. And at the, at the Technical University of Darmstadt, there are about 16 English taught master program that you can apply to. And as you can see, that the application for the winter semester is opened. This application opened about four days ago, which is the 1st of June. And normally, the application period lasts for like four to six weeks. So meaning by ending of June or mid-July, some of the application or would have been closed for you to make your application. One fascinating thing about University of Darmstadt is that if you are able to secure admission to the university, your admission letter, it is valid for two semester. And the reason they made this so is because they want you to be able to enroll for the winter semester if you're able to secure your visa on time. If your visa application gets delayed, then you can enroll for the summer semester. So with, with studies in Germany, you don't have a fixed module. They will give you uh, obligatory module and some selective. So when you even if you join at the second semester, you can choose, which is the summer semester, you can choose some programs and continue with the other students. And then in the winter of that uh, following year, you can do the program, the courses that those ones did before, before you arrive. So that way you do not miss out. So what are the programs that are taught at Darmstadt University? Hi, welcome to Impact with Alice. I'm Alice Esiola. To all new and returning subscribers, thank you for coming to this channel. If you're discovering my channel for the first time, please click on the subscribe button and remember to activate your notification bell so that you're among the first to watch the video when a new video comes out. So what are the programs that are taught at Technical University Darmstadt? If you, in order for you to find out these programs, all you have to do is click on the study section, select the part that says prospective student, and then navigate to the section that says academic record. And here we can decide whether we want to check a program in for masters or for bachelors. And I'm going to be focusing on the masters. Here we have all the programs that are taught at Technical University Darmstadt. And some of them are English taught master program. And you can see here, they already make a catalog of the English taught master program. All you have to do is to click on that. And then you will find this 16 English taught master program that you can click on and check what the requirements are for those program. So let's, for instance, I click on sustain, sustainable urban development. You can see here that it's already here that the tuition language, it's, this program is taught in English. You can read the description of what the program is all about. You can check what modules you are going to be doing, which they already split out here which they already split out here in the first semester, which is the winter semester. These are the uh, courses you are going to take in the second semester, the summer semester. You can take these in the third semester and your fourth semester is for thesis or development. Okay. Another thing you should go through is to check what are the general uh, requirements for the program. We already stated that the English language is the medium of instruction. It's a four semester program. As you already know, most master programs in Germany are four semesters. Admission for international, well, if you're applying with international qualification, all you have to do is to make sure that you provide your bachelor of science degree. And for instance, in order to apply for this sustainable, uh, sustainable urban development, they require that you have a bachelor of science degree or a Bachelor of Engineering degree in a similar area or an equivalent or degree. You have to show a proof of English proficiency, which you, you and I already know by now, that if you've previously studied in English, you can provide that as your proof of English of proficiency. And if you've not studied in English before, please write one of the English test exams. Those tests are usually valid for two years, I think. And if you want to know what the cost and budget are, just click on all these sections. And at this university, there is no tuition fee associated with the study. But as you already know that in Germany, if you are studying, you have to do, you have to pay what is known as semester contribution. And with the semester contribution, 
all you have to pay is about 245 euros 46 uh, cents that's the fee for the for the semester contribution in order to be enrolled and normally after your enrollment you then get a student id number which is more like a doing a matriculation back in your home country so how are you going to make application to this university it is as easy as abc because it's a you're going to be making application directly to the university portal and to find the university portal all you have to do is click on study select prospective student and then click on the part that says application and admission procedure if you click on that it will give you the option for online application just click on the one that says online application so that you can then follow the step-by-step -step guide in order for you to make your application the application for a study program at Technical University Darmstadt has to be done online by the application portal token. Please also note the information below on the DOSV procedure. So what is the DSOV procedure? The DSOV means Dialogue Oriented Service Procedure. And it means that first you have to register before you can then submit an application. So what I'm going to do is to directly click on this icon here that says go to token since that's the website we're going to be making an application and here you have the option to create an account since it's the first time you are navigating their website so if you click on create an account it's going to bring you here where you then still tell it to please take you to the create an account uh, portal and then you're going to enter your information email and everything after which you will get a confirmation email in your inbox you have to click on the link to verify your applic uh, to verify your registration after you have confirmed your registration for account creation through the link they sent to your inbox the next thing you want to do is to choose the degree program you want to study and as i have told you there are 16 english taught master program that you can choose from and then you can start the application process you are going to be filling in the details they will have some personal questions like your name your country of origin where you studied all those other things and then here where it says higher education and trans qualification all it's all it's inferring to is that you should provide the detail of your bachelor degree program that's if you're applying for a master program if you're applying to their master program then you're going to be providing them with the certificate of your high level uh, results wahek neko and the other ones and then you're going to click on save when you save your application it will give you a summary of all the information you've entered Carefully go through this information and when you are sure that you've provided all the right information, then you will click on the send, which is as good as saying submit. The admission office will evaluate your application and if you are found worthy of the program you've applied to, then you're going to get admission uh, letter. And remember, at the beginning of this video, I told you that a fascinating information about the admission to this university is that your admission offer it's valid for two semesters so if you're unable to catch up to register for the winter semester which you enroll to you are advised to be able to still apply in the summer semester which means after you've gotten your visa if you're able to get your visa by december instead of the october for you to enroll you can wait until april to move to germany and then start your degree program if you find this video useful, please do not forget to click on the like button because when you click the like button, YouTube promotes this video to other audience so that they too can benefit from this information. Thank you for watching today's video and until next time, bye bye. Mm -hmm.